Today, we're going to learn how to tie the half Windsor knot, which is one of the most popular necktie knots out there. Its main characteristics are one, medium sized, symmetrical in shape. Two, it is slightly more formal in nature. And three, it works well with a medium spread collar. To start tying a half Windsor knot, drape the tie over your neck. Adjust it until the wide end is longer than the narrow end. The exact length is going to vary from person to person and depending on the length of the necktie itself. First, cross the wide end of the tie over the narrow end and then bring it around and behind the narrow end. Take it over and through the opening near your neck. Wrap the wide end across the front, then under and through the neck opening. Now pull the wide end of the knot through the loop formed in the front. Tighten the knot by pulling on the wide end while holding the knot until you're satisfied with the look. Bring the knot up to your neck by holding the narrow end of the tie while pushing the knot up with your other hand. Finally, keep your tie looking tight by putting the narrow end through the keeper loop on the back of the tie. Your tie should rest between the top and middle of your belt line. If it's too short, start over, making the narrow end higher. If it's too long, start with the narrow end lower. The Half Windsor Knot is a classic tie knot that will work for any formal occasion. Be sure to check out the article and infographic for a detailed step-by-step -step look at tying the Half Windsor Knot. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and let me know in the comments what you thought of this video.